Hello, my little Boston baked beans. How you doing? Welcome to Reading Journey. I'm Journey. I'm doing a reading for the sun, moon, rising signs of whoever may need it. <laughs> I just have to remember, wait, I'm not doing no individual sign readings. What the? Anyway, I want to take a look here. Overall energy. I think I want to use this deck. First thing I heard, y'all, was I was like, okay, I wonder what the overall energy is. And I heard the word conquer. <laughs> Somebody wants to conquer. Somebody. Somebody is pissed. Oh, so pissed. Somebody's really mad at you. Who got away? Did you get away? I feel, I, I feel like I gotta whip out the Palo Santo for this. You know, we got our candle here, a white candle to bring in love and peace and harmony in the situation. Keep energy clear. Holy Spirit, if you please protect me. Archangel Michael, I might need your help on this one. I mean, I always need y'all help, but I don't know about this. That was a strong word. Conquer is a strong word here. And I didn't feel like it's you. Maybe it is you that's being determined to conquer something or conquer an, an, uh, somebody who may be your nemesis. But I feel like it's the opposite side here. It's what I felt. Let's see overall energy here. What in the world? If you're new, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I appreciate y'all. Toxic relationship. Let's get into this. Um, thank you so much for your kind donations. Thank you for your peacefulness, your love, your support. I thank you. Y'all are beautiful. I love the beautiful, peaceful, love, and light energy that we receive over here. Now, occasionally I get some cuckoos that are like, meh, 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 meh. like nobody wants to hear that. Meh, 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 meh. Okay. Actually, I do. Yes, yes, I do. Complain. Keep complaining, please. It makes it's great for my algorithm. So the more you talk, the better. For me. So keep talking. Keep talking that craziness. Those of you that be talking it. So, some type of toxic relationship happening here, huh? I see this is going to get long. We're going to do a second half, okay? And I heard escaped. I felt like somebody escaped. Somebody feels like you escaped. Somebody might have been fighting for their life. I'm getting that as well. Mm. But this person's trying to say, what are you talking? It's just a misunderstanding. It's just a misunderstanding. No, it's not. No, it's not. This is unexpected. Somebody got up and got the hell out of something. Somebody. Is somebody get? I heard changed mind. So did you tell this person that you were going to stay or you had plans and then you changed your mind? I heard changed mind. So you changed your mind. Maybe that's it, because that's what I picked up with this card. I pray and hope that you're not going back to this thing, because that energy felt really strong. I'm hearing a whiff of something. Did someone try to make you, um, is somebody, um, tried to make you into some type of, oh, what the, is this? Is somebody addicted to something? Somebody try to make you get addicted to something or try to make you stay addicted to something? Are they addicted to something? Yeah, somebody's newly single. There's something really dark and sinister about this. Somebody's newly single, whoever this is. Yeah, somebody may have became sick, single too and it, it just was unexpected. Maybe you didn't plan it or somebody did not plan for you to walk away. Somebody believes that you two were a fated meeting. But this person's crazy. This person thinks that you you guys are destined to be together or you're the twin flame or some craziness. But look, I always say to people, when you see this, look at this card. Look at her. She in a whole nother zone. And he crazy. He looking at her like he just totally nuts, as I see 444. You're protected, though, from this nut. This person, yeah, so still has feelings for you. This person may gamble a lot or take a lot of crazy risks. 
And you've been getting signs and synchronicities about this. You could have shared a home with this person. You could have been married to this person. This person is now heartbroken. This person is heartbroken. Because somebody wants to grow. Somebody was like, I want out of this. I don't want to do this anymore. Somebody let go and let God finally, because this was really, this was something really toxic. It's definitely going love related here. This is really toxic. So let me try to do this quickly for y'all because I'm going to have to get out another one that's not love related. Hold up, y'all. I don't want to do this. Hold on. Why do that? Yeah, they are hurt. They are mad. This person feels betrayed. So somebody, this is a, a toxic, uh, obviously, a toxic love connection who's like, you're not getting away from me. This person, this is the best thing you could have done was get away from this person. This person is not wrapped too tight. The elevator is not going to the top with this one. For real, this one is, is a bit scary. Secret crush. Hmm. Do you have a love for another? I think you have a love for another. Somebody has love for another person, but they have and they're but they're afraid. Because they have to take another risk. They don't know what to believe. Because this person has family on one side and friends saying, don't go to that one because she's this, she's that, she or he's this, he's that. That's not the person for you. But your intuition is telling you that this person is not a liar. This person is not like the other person. And you want to marry this person. You know that the grass is greener. If you go to this other partner, you know this. But this person is mysterious to you. They could dabble in the, in the tarot world. They could be psychic, healer, shaman. I feel like if somebody's afraid of this person because you may think they have witchy vibes or... The, these two people's religions may, or you feel like their religions don't match, but they match more than you think. This person actually may know more than you. They may be more enlightened and open to the world than you are. Because somebody, however this goes, somebody is very closed-minded. Somebody is very like, they only think one way because that's how they were raised. Society, um, this person follows a lot of society. Somebody I'm talking to, they could be, you know, in some type of secret society or some type of group or church or something like that. Very well known in the community, you know. Surrender just came out. I did see that. Let me, because I'm like looking at, I'm touching it. I'm like, why am I touching these? This ain't what I'm supposed to be reading from, but I guess so. Surrender is reversed. So I feel like. I feel like you are getting ready to get rid of this broken heart and you are getting ready to say, I don't want this anymore. I don't want this anymore. It doesn't work. It's not working. And the more you try to stay and convince yourself that, the harder it is. But somebody knows the grass is greener in another with this other person. People may call this person, you know, like, oh, they're evil, they're of the devil. But do you really know the people that you're dealing with? I want you to really think about what you have seen these other people's actions. And I think you have. This person I'm talking to, you have compared actions here. They've accused this person of doing love spells or dark things. And the person who's accusing this person over and over again is actually the person who's been doing this. And I'm hearing you've been warned. I feel like this other person tried to, excuse me, sorry y'all. The person you didn't choose 
tried to warn you, but you didn't listen because it probably, you were probably like, this person is too weird. I don't, I don't understand them. They're not like the rest of the people I hang with. They're different. But that other person is kind hearted, loving, treats people respectfully, doesn't hurt anybody, has never tried to hurt anybody, has definitely never tried to hurt you. This person though, I feel like this person cares about you as, just as much. I feel like you're going to have to go offer some type of apology or somebody's going to have to offer apology to somebody because this person was hurt also by you or however this goes. So they're not too quick to take you either. Just for you to know that, that this person kind of has their guards up as well with somebody. But I feel like this is the, pro you want to propose to this person. You do. This is the person you want to marry. I feel like you've thought about it time and time again. I think you've had dreams about this person. I feel like God's even spoken to you about this person. You know there's unfinished business here. There's something different, yeah. Unfinished business on top of truth. Some of you, there may be a truth that you need to tell, but you know that. Or someone knows they need to tell the truth to you. Social media is here. Yeah, social media. Somebody, this per, There's somebody watching. You could be watching this person also here in stalking. So somebody's watching you as well. Somebody's trying to find another on social media. Maybe you block, Maybe they blocked you. I told you somebody has their guards up with whoever this is as well. There's guards up on both sides here. This person is not sure if they can trust the other person as well. I feel like I'm talking more though to the person who walked out on somebody that they know they made a mistake. They made a wrong choice because there's an ex-lover who was walking you and I heard stalking. Who's stalking you? As I see 12, 12, maybe there won't be a second. But God is saying, stay away from this. God saying, stay away from this person. They're, they, they are horrible. They're horrible. Because if you, somebody, whoever I'm talking to, who's come out of a situation with a, a total nut, they're just going to get a new love anyway. This is what this person does. They do cycles. They cannot keep their legs yeah, they cannot keep their stuff draws on. They just can't do it. All they want is money. They're, they're, they're totally attracted to money. Money, and I'm hearing the word, you know. How do I say it clean? I can't. Money and sex, that's all they're connected to. That's their, and, and also I'm getting, I'm hearing about uh, substances. They're addicted to substances. This person doesn't have a, a, a good bone in their body. Didn't I just say substances? Literally. This person has issues and they want to party all the time. And that's all my girl wants to party all the time. But you have had a spiritual awakening. You're done with the hookups. You're done with the dating. You want something more solid, something more, um, something real. You know, I don't think I need to go much more into this. I think I'm just going to go ahead and see who's who. Because I wanted to take the read another way for my people who are here. Um... Regularly, Let's see, what time is it? Yeah, I'm gonna have to make this a little bit quicker. I gotta work out. All right, so let's take a look here. Who's who in this situation, Holy Spirit? Yeah, this is toxic. Six months ago, so somebody did something, something significant happened six months ago. Something really bad, I don't know, you would know better than me. 
or somebody wrapped up some magic or started doing some real crazy stuff six months ago, they might have shown their, okay, thank you, I see 44. Somebody showed, showed their true color six months ago. Somebody's dealing with somebody lighter, fair skin. <laughs> Or somebody light or fair skin is involved in the situation somehow. There's a water sign involved, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You could also be cussed. Somebody has gray hair that's involved. A water sign, gray hair, water sign might be in the way too. Somebody might be telling you some really, you mean crass, cross? So, so something confusing? All right, the number seven is sometime, somehow significant. For me, it means this is ended. They could also have a birthday in the month of July or the date of the seventh any month. Somebody 19 is also involved or somebody has a birthday on the 19th. The number 26 is present. They could also, somebody could be 26 or have a 26th day of a birthday. 12, 12 might be significant. You might be seeing that a lot. Somebody also might be dealing with a Virgo. <laughs> <clears throat> somehow there's a young man involved in this situation. Somebody, there's a Libra also involved. There's a female involved. There also could be a female Libra or a female with gray hair who just can't seem to keep her nose out your business. Somebody could have a birthday in May or a birthday on the on May 5th. They could also have a life path of five, life path of a seven too. There is a blue, red, or a green car also involved in this situation. Something about the 2000s is significant. Maybe that car is from the 2000s. I don't know. All right, all right, I did a few reads today. I don't plan on doing this many, but all right. But here we are together. All right. And I'm seeing 44. So some type of judgment is on this connection, y'all. Somebody's got a, so there's a judgment on this person who uh, who really did something wrong to someone. Somebody could have gotten pregnant. I'm getting that. Somebody got pregnant by somebody else. It's not somebody else's child. For you men, um, for you women, somebody, you may have gotten pregnant by somebody else or something. However that freaking applies. I don't know. Somebody from Jamaica is involved in this situation. There's a Scorpio involved in this situation. Sun, moon, and rising. The angels are protecting you guys. The angels are protecting you from this cuckoo and landing on the faded meaning card. This person, again, they, they, this is something mentally not right. Um, I think, and I'm getting this, and I don't know. You might be feeling that way, but I got an energy of somebody should have checked this person's um, to see if they were mentally stable before they committed to this person. They should have paid more to the red flags. They noticed this person has some habits. But you attracted to this person because you too had the same habits as well. Okay, there could be a Taurus involved. Also, a business could be involved in this situation. So I don't know if there's a, somebody had tied a business with somebody or they're having problems with their business because of someone else. Somebody messed up their business intentionally. I'm getting that too. Oh my God. Crazy, crazy, crazy. California is involved. West Virginia is involved. Somebody from California could be 19. Somebody from West Virginia could be 26. But either way, California and West Virginia are involved. Idaho is here as well. Idaho. No, you the ho. Yeah, I know that was coming. Anyway, influencers. So somebody's doing how somehow an influencer is involved here. Involved in this. Maybe somebody you know is an influencer. You could be the influencer. Speaker, I'm getting that as well. Somebody's podcast, somebody does a podcast, okay. Somebody from Mississippi is involved. It could be somebody, a Libra that's from Mississippi or a Scorpio that's from Mississippi. But either way, it doesn't matter what state, there's a Libra involved. Somebody, again, yeah, it could be a lazy Libra could be involved, but a regular Libra is here too. There's not a lazy Libra. But somebody la lazy is involved. There's somebody from Wisconsin that's involved they could be somebody lazy from wisconsin but either way somebody from wisconsin is here pisces is also on the scene We've got an, an uh, initial of f first last and middle vermont somebody saying get on it get get on with it <laughs> listen ops somebody's watching oh there's an ops watching who's broken hearted let me just give you a little message. They're gone. 
and they're not coming back. All right, let's go. The divine ain't going to let you do it, baby. So I suggest you stop because it looks like you're dealing with somebody who is covered by the divine. Yeah, this person's fake. Fake as shit. Or somebody fake is involved. But yeah, I just heard that. So that person is fake. Montana is here. Somebody from Montana. Somebody involved here has had a, a body augmentation. Somebody's trying to heal. Somebody with the body augmentation is trying to heal from a situation. Or there's a Pisces trying to heal. Nebraska is in the house. Kentucky is up in this camp. Florida, Alaska, Africa is involved somehow. Five or more people. Wow, five or more people have been involved in, your, in somebody's situation here. Florida's involved. That's crazy. That's too many people in your business. Michigan is present. Maine is here. Anything else? And first, last, or middle initial. We are sending signs. The divine is sending you signs, baby. Pay attention to them, okay? Especially if you're from Alaska, they're sending you signs, but they're sending you signs. Pennsylvania is in the house. New Jersey. Jersey. I never do it right. I know Jersey. I'm trying. New Mexico. All right. We're going to end it there. Thank you so much. And I saw a full moon. Somebody's been doing magic on the full moon to you every single cycle for the last four years. That's insane. You got to be freaking crazy. All right, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you want more like it, subscribe. If this is where our journey ends, I appreciate you um, allowing me on your journey. My prayers are with you, whoever this is. Um, and I hope this was... Again, I hope this I hope this was helpful to you. And if you're looking for your in individual signs, zodiac sign readings, they're very short, um, but they're there for you. Just oh, click that more button; it'll open up ever so beautifully. There's information down there about me because you know you should know about your reader um, and etc. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Blessings to you, love. Take care. And the ops, well, you know where y'all can go.